Hello everybody, and today we're just going to be doing a video on some of the Halloween 2 on 24 leaks. Uh, now before we get into this, obviously there is a spoiler warning for this, uh, for people that you know, obviously don't want to get involved with the leaks, or don't think enough, D spoiler warning. Uh, but, uh, so I just wanted to ch check out some of the stuff because I know I am not really up to date with my channel with on the animatronic stuff, it's just because I wanted to do some other stuff before I got into the Halloween stuff again, you know? I have heard of all the stuff, I know Demonica came back, I know all that already. It's just that I never really, you know, wanted to talk about it just yet. And I'm finally picking back for my hibernation, I guess, but uh, we're gonna talk about it and uh, check out like all the low stuff in Spear Halloween stuff. First I want to talk about the Spear Halloween stuff, I don't have any pictures of the Spear Halloween stuff. For the low stuff, I'm just gonna go through Jam Han's video O's, and uh, m hopefully some other videos, like maybe some shorts or something. Because I know there is videos of them in action, not all of them, but some of them. Uh, I think most of it is just pictures though, and I do want really, I am interested in some of these. These are, look pretty cool, and Lowe's does look a, getting a little better. There is some stuff that I'm like, that is kind of fucking like stupid, but we'll talk about it um, in a second. So for Spring Halloween, I know there's a lot of Gremlins stuff that got leaked, which I'm really interested in, hopefully in Gremlins animatronic. I know they got the license for Five Nights at Freddy's. I'm not thinking animatronic, but hopefully some cool merch from them, and um, Hopefully for Course Bride too. Um, and I know a new Mars Attack statue is coming out, and that sounds interesting. I think a Michael Myers side stepper is coming out too, and it looks okay. <laughs> it's, I, we saw the pic. I saw the pictures, but I'm not really gonna. Sh I don't feel like showing them yet. Maybe I will at the end of the video, but I want to get to the little stuff first because I, that's the most important part, obviously, right now. S so here's the first animatronic from Jam Han's video. Um, it's the deep sea diver. Um. And go to his channel if you go more into depth from it. I think he said it was two hundred forty nine dollars, which is kind of a lot. And I know there is two pictures. There's one picture where he has the spear like this, and the, this one he looks like he has this one like this. I think the other one is probably the prototype, unless his movement is like it going like this. But I doubt it, kind of. But he looks freaking amazing. This is the one of the ones that I think I might get. I'm probably not because I'm I spent a lot last year. I'm not gonna, I'm probably only gonna get one animatronic this year because they're getting way more expensive now and I don't really respect that. I know it's infl inflation, but freaking Home Depot kept their prices pretty low and I don't know how, you know, stuff like Spirit can't, couldn't. Um, I mean, I guess Spirit is, has always been expensive, but Lowe's is getting like way more now and this does look good. But I doubt it's going to look this good when you buy it, but it looks good. It, it's a cool animatronic. I love the idea of it. I love the aqua, all that. It reminds me of Scooby-Doo, um, you know, the... Forgot his freaking name. I forgot the ghost's name. Something. <laughs> but yeah, he's really, really cool. I really do like him, and if I'm going to get an unlicensed character, it would probably be this one until I see Home Depot make some cooler stuff, I guess, because we haven't seen all of it yet, obviously. Maybe Spirit has some cool unlicensed stuff. Um, usually they're my least favorite with the unlicensed stuff, but maybe they'll change my mind, uh, so do good spirit, I guess, I don't freaking know. Uh, but I'm happy that Lowe's is getting way better now, uh, because they have always been kind of, kind of stinky, you know? But yeah, this one lo does look really good, I'm really excited. Now the next one he lists in this video is the, what is it, Captain Pirate? Captain Sea Pirate? I don't think I know. Uh, it looks like a aqua, like, fisherman pirate with a wheel, and I think that's actually pretty freaking cool. Um, it does look weird with him just with the wheel. I think he's also the same price as the scuba diver guy, which is, like, three hundred, like $350. I think he would look cool, though, if you had those that fog thing and you put a laser in it, though. I think that would look freaking sick with him. Uh, honestly, I think that would look so freaking sick with him. But um, I do like his design here. I doubt he's gonna look that good but with the darkness around the face it looks cool i'm sure he's actually gonna have a face obviously and it's probably gonna be well hidden if you use the right lighting I, it looks like a light is coming from his wheel too which is actually would probably look pretty cool like it like lights up on him hopefully not like down but like you know where it kind of just highlights him a little bit more so you can actually see him and i believe all he does is this, this and i'm sure his head probably moves or something but yeah, it looks freaking cool. I really do like the idea. I don't think I'm gonna buy this guy because I don't really have a use for him. Uh, I, 
none of my animal tracks would fit them at all. Like, I have Leatherface and stuff. There's no way. None of the, same with Scooby Diver, but Scooby Diver is freaking cool. I can make that into a Scooby Doo freaking that Scooby Doo ghost. This guy I can't. No, well, maybe I could, but I don't know. I I would I would, I would rather just get Scooby Diver. I don't know. He's cool though. Yeah, for a pirate prop, I do really freaking like him. He's pretty freaking cool. I like him. Anyway, next one. I I didn't even actually know about this one. This apparently this is an LED Kraken, and that's actually pretty freaking sick, man. I actually do really like that. I hope he's like huge, like really freaking big, because if that is what it is, that's pretty cool. The only thing I don't really like is how his tentacles really glow. I wish that his eyes weren't white. I wish he just had regular eyes, but that's fine. His sculpt looks good. I just wish that his tentacles and eyes weren't like lighting up. I think that looks a little weird. Besides that, that's pretty freaking cool. I do like that. That's pretty cool. Like Aqua animatronic. I don't know how much he is. I don't know. I'm, I'm not. I'm too lazy to check. I'm assuming he's like a lot of like 300 or something. I don't know. And now we're gonna get into the ones that I think are stinkers. This is the sea witch, the deep sea siren witch. I don't really like her. I. She looks okay. Uh, I don't really like her. I. I don't know. I don't like her. I. <laughs> I just don't like it. But. I'm sure if you're like a witch fan, maybe someone will like it. I don't know. I don't really have much to say about her. I'm assuming she's like 250 or something at the most. Unless if she does something like the same movement, you never know. But she's fine to me. I don't know. Next animatronic. Another freaking stinker is the grave digger. I don't like this guy. I don't know. I just don't think he looks that cool. I he's a 12 foot animatronic. I'm. I don't like it. I, d I don't like how he's 12 feet. I don't like his design. I think in... The oh my god, that's good. the out of me. I think the in-store uh, animatronic um, from the leaks we saw, his face is like gray or something, like white, and he kind of has like black makeup on him. Which both don't really... I don't like. Uh, both I don't like. I don't, I don't care. I just don't like this one. That cheap freaking skeleton looks a little weird to me, too. Next animatronic. <laughs> Next we got... Wednesday Adams. Uh, I watched Wednesday. I thought it was a great show. I thought good show. Not like great, great, but good. It's a good show. It's a decent show. One of the best things we got from Tim Burton in a while. And I don't really like it. I, <laughs> I mean, it, it looks good here, but when you look at like the Insta stuff, it doesn't even look like her. Like it doesn't even look like Jenna. But here it looks fine. I don't really like that. A t like attire, whatever, freaking outfit. I don't like the Raven Dance stuff. I think it was a little cringy because everybody kept freaking reposting and going like, <laughs> like it was. It just it just kept being reposting and stuff. But anyway, good show, good scene, I guess. But it just kind of get overrated to me. I really wish it was just regular freaking uh, Wednesday. And I also would like if they made one of the monster, because the monster does really freaking remind me of a Tim Burton design, and that would be so cool as an animatronic. But yeah, I don't really have much to say about this. I think she's probably like $300, I don't know. I just realized I forgot to list the pricing for these. I probably should have listed them, but... Let's move on. <laughs> okay, so the next one where it's apparently called Adam's Family. I don't know why you call it Adam's Family. GM Haunts, this is a cousin it. Jesus Christ. Uh, but it's cousin it. <laughs> it's not that hard. It's literally just a bag of hair. Um, not really much to say about it. It's cousin it. <laughs> it's, it's like it's it's cool. I like cousin it. Uh, looks kind of cheap, as you expect. It, it seems like they just made this because they're like, oh, it's so freaking easy. It's just a bag of hair. Let's just put it on there and make it like all like. And that's it. I think that's all it does. I think it just turns. Uh, by the way, the Wednesday Adams goes like this and goes like. Okay, that's all it does. <laughs> we'll, we'll look at the images of these. I think he just turns side to side. I don't know if he has audio, probably not, because all he does is go. But yeah, he cousin it, amazing character. I I like cousin it, but this is looks kind of cheap. I would rather just buy something else. No, I forgot this freaking guy's name was it Jack Jack Horn or something. I don't freaking know. Uh, but he's from Wednesday. He's the main villain, whatever. I don't like him. <laughs> I, d I don't like him, uh, especially the in-store produce model looks kind of bad, like his, he looks fine there, but then in the in-store he looks way, way freaking cheaper, and I just don't like him, I, I don't, I don't know, I don't like this one, I think he's also like $300, um, 
I don't remember what he does. I know his mouth moves or something. Does his mouth move or does it? No, it just lights up, I believe. And I'm assuming the fog comes out, and maybe he like lifts up the steer, the st the, the spear, or like kind of moves it side to side or something. I don't know what he does. Uh, I'm assuming a lot of fog stuff with him, which is kind of cool. Yeah, I think this is made by. I don't know why I'm gonna list company names. I think most of these are made by Techie, but. Yeah, I don't really like this one. I don't like his hair or anything. I, I don't like it. Um, I, you know what I really like? If they made a freaking Jack uh, Carter animatronic, that would actually be freaking cool. Uh, but at the Thanksgiving thing, but that would still be freaking cool. I would like that, actually. Um, but yeah, that's fine animatronic. It's fine. <laughs> the next animatronic I'm going to be talking about is the Balancing Clown. Um, this is the other video from GM Hans. Uh, this balancing clown doesn't look that bad. He looks kind of goofy, which I don't really like, but it's not bad. Like, his face looks kind of cool. Uh, Techie has always been kind of better to me when it comes to clowns. I almost just clicked the video. Um, when it comes to clowns, he always they always uh, kind of surprise me. Like, I like the clown on stilts. I thought he was fine. This one, I think, is one of my least favorite ones they made. It's still not bad, though. It's still not bad. Uh, I don't really like that he's balancing like this. Like, it kind of looks just goofy, too goofy to me. It's a cool concept for, like, people that do like clowns and stuff, but it's just not my cup of tea. Um, but he's, he's decent. Uh, I believe his movement is just him going like this with the pins, and then his head spins. I don't know if it's all the way around or if it's just, like, that. This goes, like, side to side. Or, and I know his feet move up and down, which kind of looks... It looks decent. It looks decent. I think that's a good movement for him. But yeah, let's uh, move on to the next ones. I don't really have much to say about this one. I don't like this one at all. It looks freaking cheap. Voice crack. Jesus. Looks cheap. This is the Tombstone Zombie. I'm assuming it's a hundred bucks. I don't freaking know, man. I don't really like this one. It just looks kind of cheap. I don't know. Same with this one. I don't really have much to say about him. He's the Jump Scare Pumpkin... Just cheap, freaking ever, not original, just, I mean, uh, generic, whatever, it's just not my thing, I don't know if I can know, not my thing, it's okay, <laughs> holy, holy Jesus, how many stinkers are there, holy frick, man, I just want to get to the good stuff now, Reaper Rapper, does he freaking rap or something, this is so freaking stupid, man, oh my god, <laughs> I don't like these at all, I don't like these ones, <laughs> Uh, moving on, uh, whatever, buy it, freaking a hundred bucks, I don't freaking know. UGH! That's Haunted Mansion? The night. The body doesn't look bad, what happened to the head though, man? What are those eyes? I know, I saw the insert pictures, it does look better. The head though, like, why'd you mold the helmet with the head? It looks like he's wearing those Indian hats. It looks weird don't uh, I'm kind of disappointed the body looks good again the body looks freaking good I like that I love the Haunted Mansion stuff I love Haunted Mansion and I'm glad there's more Haunted Mansion stuff coming up but oh my god that head does not look good at all why is his head like his head should be like this like it's supposed to be droopy why is it like weird and again why is his helmet like molded with his head it just doesn't look right it just doesn't look right Overall, though, the body does look pretty sick. I do like the body. The body looks really good. And I'm sure this is, like, a black light picture. I don't know, though. This picture looks a little weird. The body looks fine, but the eyes look weird here. I know in person it looks better, but still. Um, but, yeah, a really cool black light animatronic if you need one. Oh, my God. How many? Holy frick, man. Oh, I just moved that. <laughs> Hold on, let me... Holy frick, man. That looks so terrible. Why do you keep moving? This looks terrible. What is this? Is this a gargoyle? Yeah, it's a graveyard gargoyle. I'm assuming he pops up. <laughs> that looks terrible. <laughs> what is this? Is this like $300? What is this? This looks. This is like the Desmodus, uh, but worse. That looks terrible. Like I just hate that it's all fabric. Like If it, it was like plastic, maybe it wouldn't look that bad. But the fact that it's fabric, it looks terrible. According to GM Hans, forgot to pause the video <laughs> if you didn't see that um uh but uh apparently gm hans said that there's uh pictures of the actual display uh for the managers and stuff damn i would wish this is like an in-person freaking setup man that looks cool 
we always wanted the castle theme, that, like at Spirit and stuff. I believe this year people have been saying there's a, a carnivore or something, and something else. I forgot what it was, but it's. I know a carnival is one of them. There's something else, and that does kind of prove it because there's a carnival uh, door thing uh, releasing. But yeah, that looks freaking sick. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> we also got a picture of the the balancing clown and. It looks pretty freaking cool there. It looks pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. We also got a picture of the bone collector, uh, which is that one guy, the grave digger, whatever the fuck his name was, and still not a fan of him. Guess it looks a little better, but still not that great. <laughs> to be honest, that sea hag on the left kind of. Is that the siren witch? Is, that's a whole different design. She kind of reminds me of that, uh. The fucking uh, King Kong ride, you know, the queue, when she's like, Kong, Kong, that's what it reminds me of with that old lady in the, the animatronic that everybody was so impressed with for Universal. Uh, but we, the main thing is obviously that sea captain on the right. A lot of people are talking about him, a lot of people like him. It's a cool concept, I will say. It's a cool concept, I do like what they're going for it. I just don't really like the face. Maybe if it was painted better, like if I repainted it and it looks a little better. Maybe I'd like it, but it just I don't really like it. I don't know. I do like the, the I guess the tentacles coming out. It's very aqua, you know. I do like the hook. I, it's a cool concept. I just don't think I really like it. But maybe the motion will be cool. I'm assuming he just moves his arm up and stuff, and maybe his head a little bit. It's a cool design. It's unique, but I don't know. It's just not my type of thing. Again, oh yeah, the kraken's up there too. I didn't even notice. Damn, that Kraken is huge! Holy fuck, man. That Kraken is... Ooh. That might be more than 300. <laughs> that might be more. That's actually kind of cool. That looks kind of cool. I didn't even notice the Kraken on the top. But yeah, the setup is freaking awesome. Okay, there's the Siren Sea Witch, whatever the fuck her name was. Uh, the Popeye freaking villain. She looks terrible. Uh, <laughs> I don't like her. The last, that last witch looked way cooler. This one looks terrible. Uh, there's the haunted sea diver. Why does he look like he's like, like hunched over? He looks a little weird there, but he looks cool. He looks cool. So yeah, I think that proves my theory that he's actually like this, not like this with the thing. Uh, I do really like him though. He looks freaking awesome there. Same with the sea captain. He looks cool. He looks cool. They both look cool. Besides the freaking witch. I think I forgot to point out there was uh, like two new band members. One is a singer. One is a pianist. It's cool. I, I never really cared about the band stuff, but if you... I do like the do, Don't Fear the Reapers. <laughs> it's it's kind of cool. But I was never really a fan of them, but it's cool because you can connect to Bluetooth. It's just a hell of a lot of money to get all of them, though. Ugh! That looks terrible. Holy moly. I can see some Squid Game stuff up there, and also Michael Myers and uh, Chucky. And my boy Haunted Mansion and the cat. That's actually pretty sick, man. Uh, yeah, the the knight does look better there. His head just looks so off. I think it's too wide. I, th I just think it's too wide. It just looks so freaking off. But besides that, the body looks really good. The body looks good. It's just that head. Just that head. The cat is cool. The plaque is cool. It's Haunted Mansion. I like that. I like that a lot. So I just found this video from Bandon Tyler Productions or something, whatever. Let's check it out. Why not? We can see the balancing clown there. We can see two Mickey Mouses, whatever the fuck. We can see the Haunted Mansion and all that. See the Kraken. We see that the sea diver a little bit. We saw that witch for a little bit. That's pretty sick, man. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, those pumpkins. So we do see some of them in action, but not all of them. Uh, this is... Yeah, we do see that guy in action a little bit. It looks like he turns to the side and goes like this. Do we see anybody else in action? Yeah, we see that witch in action for a little bit. You can't hear anything. I think I heard a scream or something. But yeah, that's basically one video we got. I think there's another like really good one we got. Then this is the one. This is the one that everybody's talking about, I believe. Oh, he does more movement than I thought, because then it goes like... 
like that. There's like a little Wednesday there, I just noticed that. Uh, what else do I see? I see the Haunted Mansion plaque, I forgot that's also for sale. Yeah, there's this movement. It's pretty sick, man. Looks cool. We see a little bit more of them. We see that singer there, the singer I was talking about. Than that. That's pretty sick. That's pretty sick. Not gonna lie. Like they like that's a pretty good freaking video actually. That's like a high quality video. I don't even know who that is. I don't even think I talked about her, but she looks okay. That's uh, is that Haunted Mansion? No, that's not Haunted Mansion, is it? That looks nothing like a ghost I know. But yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool. This is the Morse costume stuff, I forgot to say. So, let's talk about these. Uh, he looks okay, he looks kind of generic, to be honest. Not my type. I don't know how much he is or anything, but the movement looks pretty good. There's there's him in the dark. Looks pretty plain. Looks like a factory demo for Morse costumes. I'm assuming it is. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Pretty cool to see this stuff early. Well, I know this one, everybody's talking about this is like the sword swallower eater or whatever. It's a cool concept. I won't agree. It's a cool concept. That's pretty... It's a cool concept. I like that. Uh, but I don't really... I don't like how his body's like... Uh, it's weird. It's not my type of prop, but it's a cool concept, though. <laughs> it's kind of funny. This just seems like a like a gargoyle. It's cool. Yeah, it looks pretty good. Does it do anything or no? Does it just light up? It's pretty cool. It's it's cool just for like a static grab. I think that's cool. It looks pretty cool lit up. I don't really care about this one. <laughs> it just kind of shakes. It's okay. That had to be pretty cool. I like that one. I like that one, actually. That's pretty cool. I believe he's pretty tall, too, in person. I like that one. I actually really like that one. No, it's cool. <laughs> it's a cool concept. So, so yeah, I think that's basically all I wanted to talk about for like, you know, the Halloween season and all that. I am really excited to see what we do have in store because it looks like there is a lot of interesting stuff so far, especially from Lowe's. Um, I'm really excited to see, um, especially from Spirit, from Lowe's, from uh, Home Depot, because Home Depot always, Home Depot always ends up to be my favorite. So I'm really freaking excited to see what is like you know the theming and stuff for each of these companies. But yeah, that's basically it for this video. Um, Tell me what prop you guys like the most out of all the ones I've shown in this video and all that. So yeah, that's basically all about it. That's basically, like, catching you up to date, I guess, if you're not. See you guys later.